and parish officials on high alert. Authorities have a close eye on micro earthquakes, earthquakes also known as MEQs, and as News 2's Adrian Pittman reports, these small quakes raise a lot of concern. Ernest Boudreau grew up on the bayou, but for him, it's not what it used to be. Me and like a lot of other people were born and raised here. I mean, now you just, it's nothing now. You wouldn't be able to tell by looking on the surface, but down below, it's a different story. Not knowing what's going to happen. That's the biggest thing you don't ever know. This sinkhole in Bayou Corn isn't the only problem growing. Now micro earthquakes have been added to the list of concerns. I want to get out of here. I mean, I don't want to be here. I mean, it's not even a home no more. I mean, what, what you doing here, I mean, paying for something that ain't worth nothing. MEQs are small earthquakes. When the small quakes started about two weeks ago, there were about 10 to 15 a day. But this week, that all changed to about three to 500 a day. If something else is gonna happen, something they ain't gonna be able to stop. Parish officials are paying close attention since this is the first time MEQs have been registered in the area. I know, we, we don't know what's what's gonna happen because there's nothing that we can refer to that this this has happened before. Assumption Parish OEP manager John Boudreaux hopes this doesn't affect the sinkhole, but whatever happens, he says the parish is ready. Throughout this event, we've had uh, unique uh, situations, and again, this is something that you know, we don't know what's gonna happen, but uh, again, we have to stay uh, true and 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 uh, and continue to monitor and see what ultimately does happen. Adrian Pittman, WBRZ, Balance News. News 2 contacted Texas Brine, the company called responsible for the sinkhole. It says this activity isn't unexpected. It's part of the settling process.